Yo, what up, guys? Today I'm bringing you Archive Assault Episode 2 with the Cartier Brutel sunglasses. So, right now they're on the resale market for around $3,000. Cartier came out in 1847. Yeah, that long ago. And they were known for their detail and their prestige. And they came out with the famous sunglass line. Cartier being so old and me liking vintage older objects, stuff with history, you know, I had to get some sunglasses, not from now, but from the 1990s. Let's get into some Cartier vintage glasses. So, these were from 1990. I bought them resale for about two grand, but they go for, I think, three now. And they have a very classic Cartier square design. So the bridge has these three gold lines, and then underneath that, the two pads. They of course have the infamous Cartier crest. It's getting really yellow, kind of gross, but I mean, over time, what could you expect? They're from the 90s. Um, I have a lot of wear on these, a lot of damage. I've repaired these so many times. I'll throw some B-roll, but I got them soldered before they cracked over here actually. Cracked in half, the lenses came out, I put, had to put new lenses in. I put clear ones and then when, when it's sunny outside, whatever, it becomes sunglasses. So that's fine, polarized, it's amazing. That this sick, sick dark wood all the way around the temples, it's insane, it's beautiful. They have these gold detailings all the way around. The gold Cartier at the end, of course. My favorite is the gold accessory over the temple. That little bar, it's just such a flip. Yes, yeah, so talking more about getting them soldered. I brought them to my local eyeglass shop. It was like $45. He, fit, he reshaped them, so they fit me perfect now. They were crooked, and he soldered them over there. I'll throw some detailed clips up. It's pretty bad. You still could see it a little bit, but it's way better than it was. And there's also this crazy, I don't know if you could see it, but there's this crazy crack on the temple, but it hasn't done anything to the glasses, so I just let it rock, honestly. Hold on. These are just such a classic frame. They'll never get old. I can have them throughout my whole life. They'll, they'll be fun. I'll keep getting these repaired until literally they break. I can't wear them anymore. They snap or whatever. I mean, I've got, they've snapped and I've gotten them fixed, so you could see how much I'm gonna wear. Maybe you could check on Grailed or eBay for these. I don't know what your best bet is. I know Cartier doesn't do authentications themselves. You could take it to a jeweler if it's 18 karat gold or whatever, have the jeweler make sure, test it, it's 18 karat gold. You see that way, you know, the jewel, the hardware is real. Most likely, the garment's gonna be real. Who's gonna put 18 karat gold on a fake garment? But, you know, people might do it, who knows. So, before I end this video, I wanna tell you guys one last thing. Every single sunglass looks better with a certain facial structure. So, say you have an oval face, there's a a certain glass that will look better on your face than a different pair of glasses. And to end the video, I'm going to show you guys what they look like on me. So two, more to come in the future. See you guys soon. Thinking about my next move in my thinking chair.